it may seem intimidating making omena but with these few steps you're actually going to make the best omena recipe the key ingredient in this video is coconut cream and i have a third cup of the cream to get started i'm going to place a pan over medium heat and then i'm going to add some cooking oil as the oil is getting hot i have one and a half cup of fried omena so this is how it's looking like and it's fried to perfection so i'm going to add in some onions to my pan garlic and ginger saute the onions garlic and ginger until a little bit golden brown Once the onions are starting to brown, I'm going to add in two diced tomatoes. Next, add in my spices, which you're going to find listed in the description box. Stir in. Add in a little bit of coriander to the cooking tomatoes toss everything together when you notice that the pan is drying out you can add a splash of water so that the tomatoes can cook through also while chopping the coriander i added the stems because they have immense flavor so don't throw away the stems this is looking absolutely delicious at this point to balance out the acidity of the tomatoes i'm going to add in a quarter teaspoon of sugar start in the sugar and at this point i'm ready to add in my omena start in this is going to be super tasty just look at that also at this point i'm going to add in some red and green capsicum toss everything together add in a splash of water reduce the flames to low and let the omena simmer for around two minutes if you notice that the pan is drying out, you can add some more water and let the omena cook until it has softened up. I added one seasoning cube to my pan. So to fully season my omena, I'm going to add in some salt. Stir in. At this point, I'm going to add in some coconut cream stir in the coconut cream into the omena and this is looking very creamy and delicious let this simmer for around two minutes and lastly i'm going to garnish with some coriander Stir in the coriander. And let me tell you, after adding all those spices and the coconut cream, the omena is looking so good. Once the omena is ready, serve while hot with some ugali. I absolutely love pairing mine with some brown ugali. So I hope you'll be trying out this recipe, which is very easy and simple.